Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's going to be a little bit of a different video and I'm going to show you where I get some of my free CAD blocks online. So these CAD blocks are a furniture that you may have seen in my warehouse design series video. They are a furniture, toilets, sinks, doors. I have a couple other ones too that deal with um, computers. Again, these are going to be free CAD blocks that I bring in and they're going to be online. I'm going to show you real quick. Before we get into the video, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you like the video, give it a like down below. If you think this video could be helpful for someone else who's drafting or designing, give it a share. And if you want to see anything else done in AutoCAD, leave it in the comments section below. All right, so as previously stated in the beginning of the video, what we're going to do is we're going to learn how to bring free CAD blocks into our current drawing. So these CAD blocks can be anything from interior design pieces. I've seen cars. I've seen um, the Eiffel Tower. In one of my videos, I used a hot air balloon that I brought in from them. There are trees, things that are outdoors like that, a whole bunch of different options that you can import into your drawing for free. Now, to do this, you're going to need to have access to a web browser, and I prefer Chrome. So we're going to go over there, and I already pre-typed in the website that I currently use, but I use cad-block.com. Now, not everything on this website is free, but most of it that you need for basic level CAD drawings is. So, for example, you have things on the side like appliances, architecture, electronics, computer, furniture, gates and fences. There's a ton of different options that you can see and use and download without paying. You can also pay for them as well. As you can see here, we have a bunch of examples of vehicles. You have a Volkswagen, Mercedes, um, Bentley. You can pay for all of those CAD blocks and bring them in, and they're actually pretty reasonably priced. But for this example, what we're going to do is we're going to come up here to the search bar and we're going to type in furniture and we're going to click enter. So once we click enter, the furniture shows up and what we're going to do is we're just going to scroll down a little bit. And as you can see here, there's nothing here that is free, but we're going to come to page number four. And once we clicked on page number four, it should show you this page right here. And we're going to come down to modern office furniture. Now you can see there's things like conference room furniture, classic furniture, and modern office furniture. And then you can scroll down and see a baby cradle and an easel. But we're going to click conference room or modern office furniture, excuse me. We're just going to click on the image itself. Now, once you click on the image, you'll come over here to the right and you're going to click download CAD blocks. We're going to left click on that and it is going to start the download process of all of these furniture blocks to a DWG file. Now, once those are downloaded, you're gonna come up here, and in Chrome, it shows you when they've been downloaded. We are gonna access it. You can also go to it through your computer as well into the download section. We're gonna left click, and it's going to open up that download CAD file, a DWG file, those free furniture CAD blocks into a separate CAD file. So. We're going to come here. They're all black right now. We are just, to, for visibility's sake, we are just going to turn them white. And as you can see here now, we have all of our different CAD blocks inside of our CAD file. All right, so now that we have our block downloaded into our drawing, or all of these blocks, what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to go ahead and erase everything. Now, the reason we can do this is because when you download the free CAD block download that you saw, what it will actually do is not only bring it into your drawing, but it'll also put all of those individual blocks into the block library. So to view this, we're going to come here to block and we're going to click insert. And as you can see here now, I can insert every single block that we just saw on the screen into the drawing individually. So for example, we want to insert this table, we can, or if we want to insert this table, we can do so. Either way, you can erase all of those blocks and then just insert them individually. But since you downloaded that file, you will now have access to all of those blocks to bring into your drawing. You can also edit them, you can edit the attributes, and if you wanna just get rid of them off the screen, you can delete them as well. All right, so that's gonna wrap up the video here. Real quick, I just wanna clarify that I am not affiliated with cadblock.com in any shape, form, or fashion, and they are not paying me to advertise for them. I just found it to be a worthwhile website that I wanted to share with everyone else for free CAD blocks, specifically furniture for your drawing and design. So with that being said, I do appreciate you guys watching. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, give it a share, and I'll see you guys in the next one.